Now, here's meteorologist TJ Del Santo with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. Well, Earl is gone and it is super comfortable outside here in the weather yard with blue skies, nice gentle breeze, and low humidity as well. Let's take a look at what's going on. The live Pinpoint Doppler 12 radar showing no showers out there, and I think we're going to remain uh, plenty dry throughout the course of the overnight as there's a ton of dry air spilling into the region. But in Earl's Wake, we still have that high surf advisory in effect for the south coast of Massachusetts and Rhode Island, especially out there on the Cape and Islands. We're seeing some uh, fairly high surf. Live beach cam from down there in Narragansett. Every once in a while, we get a set of waves, two to four feet coming on through. But you can see some people in the water there, but just be careful because there's a uh, fairly moderate risk of rip currents right through the evening, overnight, and into tomorrow morning. High temperatures today, upper 70s to low 80s across the region. It was super comfortable. Look at the uh, blue sky out there. Temperature is 77 with a wind from the west-southwest. Still pretty busy at 21 miles an hour. The dew point extra low at 51. Ray and Tina in Pawtucket reporting on that tenth of an inch of rain after midnight last night. Left over from Earl. Warm, windy, and dry now, though, with a temperature of 73 degrees. 72 in Smithfield, 76 Newport. Westerly right now at 76 degrees. Very comfortable night with a low humidity and temperatures not too bad at all. Notice some clouds and showers off to our west. They're going to try and work their way into our area, but they're going to be melting away as they bump into some relatively drier air. Cold front came on through, helped to get rid of Earl. There he is up there in the Canadian Maritimes. will continue to work its way far away from us. We'll just get drier air and cooler air continuing to move on in throughout the night. Your Sunday, we're still going to have a bit of a breeze around, especially in the morning and into the early afternoon. We'll have lots of sunshine, still dry weather, high pressure controlling our weather into Monday as well with plenty of sunshine, maybe a teensy bit warmer during your uh, Monday afternoon compared to what we'll have tomorrow. Live Pinpoint Doppler 12 neighborhood future cast showing the conditions for tonight. A few clouds coming on through. Here we are tomorrow morning around quarter to nine with lots of sunshine holding on to the sun into tomorrow evening, staying dry into uh, tomorrow evening around 7 o'clock. So for this evening, mainly clear, cool, a little bit breezy, temperatures falling through the 70s and 60s after midnight, quite cool by dawn. Look at these temperatures, down at around 55 degrees, might even be some upper 40s, some of the more sheltered valleys, sheltered from the wind inland. Chilly start tomorrow morning, a little bit breezy, temperatures climbing through the 50s and 70s, still a little bit breezy into the early afternoon tomorrow as well, with plenty of sunshine, highs in the mid-70s and Central Falls in the east side, 75, 76 degrees or so in Riverside, Cranston, and Warwick. Along the south shore, we're looking at temperatures to be topping out at around 75, 76 degrees or so, including at the beaches. You'll find highs in the mid-70s with lots of sun up in northern Rhode Island, about 76 degrees in Chepachet. Southeastern Massachusetts, we're looking at highs around 76 in Swansea, New Bedford, Fall River, about 75, 76. Seven-day future cast, delightful weather right through Labor Day, even into Tuesday. A cold front comes on through late Wednesday, brings a few showers, then it gets cooler and drier as we head into next weekend. And for the Pinpoint Futurecast, anytime, you can always get our iPhone app. You can download it using iTunes. Just search for WPRI. So we are looking at beautiful weather right through the night, tomorrow, even into Monday. Looking at the tropics, there's a couple of disturbances that we're watching, but they're way out there in the Atlantic. No threat to us, no immediate threat to us. That's good, and it's hard to believe that it was even raining yesterday it's at all. A what a difference a day makes. It's amazing. The old saying. <laughs> Thanks so much, TJ. Yeah. Coming up. On